My name is Pardis Parker. I work in Hollywood, and it is mostly rejection. The worst part is that people try to stay your friend after rejecting you. Just the other day, I emailed a proposal to someone. They emailed me back to reject the proposal, but then they signed off their email by saying, but I'm rooting for you. I didn't know how to reply. So I just wrote back, thanks. I'm rooting for you too. I didn't understand, man, but then I thought about it. I was like, you know what? Actually, this makes sense. It reminds me of that famous scene from the movie 300, where a Persian emissary took a proposal to King Leonidas, and Leonidas rejected the proposal. And the emissary said, this is madness. And Leonidas said, madness? This is Sparta! And then he kicked the emissary into a bottomless pit of despair. And while the emissary was falling, to his certain death, Leonidas peeked over the edge of the pit. He looked the emissary dead in the eyes and he yelled out, but I'm rooting for you. <laughs> and the emissary said, thanks, I'm rooting for you too. I don't need you to root for me, man. I need your help. Life's hard. I'm struggling. I told my friend I was struggling. She goes, haven't you ever read any autobiographies? Anyone who's made it has had to struggle. And I was just like, yeah. You know who else has had to struggle? Anyone who hasn't made it. <laughs> yeah, but we don't hear their stories. No, because for some reason, they don't get book deals. Page one, life was a struggle. Page two, the end. <laughs> yeah, the book was both depressing and brief. Life's hard, man. I'm struggling. And I'm tired of people telling me to grind. I'm tired of it. I'm tired of it. I don't believe it anymore. I saw this quote the other day. It said, they sleep, I grind. <laughs> Why? <laughs> like, maybe you wouldn't need to grind so much if you were better rested. <laughs> like maybe the motto should be, they sleep, I sleep. <laughs> because it's nighttime. <laughs> and I'm not a literal owl. <laughs> I saw another quote that said, the grind is everything. I was just like, no, it's not. They do studies about what old people regret and zero of them ever say, Man, I wish I grinded more. <laughs> now, the number one answer in all those studies is, man, I wish I didn't work so hard. Because working sucks. And we're worried about robots taking our jobs. Why? <laughs> Take them? <laughs> Take all of them? It's like, oh yeah, but flipping burgers is my identity. It's like, dude, get a new identity. If you can flip a burger, you can hold a mic and segue to a job that will make your parents even less impressed. <laughs> tired, man. Tired of people telling me to grind. I think part of the problem, too, is a lot of people are just grinding to get rich, you know? And not a little rich, but like rich, rich. It just seems selfish to me. People say, oh, well, you shouldn't judge. You know why people want to get rich. People want to get rich to give back to society. You ever think of that? Partis? Like, no, I haven't. Because I listen to music. Case in point, 2010, Bruno Mars released a song called Billionaire. First line of the chorus, I want to be a billionaire. So effing bad. Like, oh, oh, why, Bruno? Why do you want to be a billionaire? Is it to give back to the peoples of the world? Here's the full chorus. I want to be a billionaire so effing bad to buy all of the things I never had. 
And it's just like, yo, Bruno, what did you never have that a billion dollars is your barrier to entry? <laughs> like you're just sitting off in the corner somewhere, impoverished, just thinking to yourself, oh, 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 if only I had more money so I could finally buy a large bridge. <laughs> I'll really help with my predicament. I'm like, oh, 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 if only my fortunes would turn so I could finally purchase the Suez Canal. <laughs> I'll really help tide me over. I'm like, oh, oh, oh. Oh, 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 if only I had a billion dollars so I could finally afford a Dyson vacuum cleaner. <laughs> Real talk, that is the only reason I want to be rich, is to buy a Dyson vacuum cleaner. I know that they're just regular vacuums, but I see the commercials and I buy all the hype. All of it. It's like, what am I going to do? Go back to using a regular vacuum? Like a pleb? Like a peasant? Like some commoner whose vacuum doesn't have aerospace engineering? It's just like, yeah, I could buy a used car, or I could buy a vacuum, which instead of using bags, uses Zyklone technology. Do you understand? I could clean my carpets with the suction power of a natural disaster. <laughs> You know what's really crazy? Is that if you go to the Dyson website, it says that James Dyson went through over 5,127 prototypes before landing on a working model, and you're supposed to read that and be like, oh wow, like I guess he like spent a lot of time like perfecting the technology. And it's just like, yeah, maybe, or maybe he just sucks at making vacuums. <laughs> so I don't believe in grinding to get rich, man. You know what's crazy? You know what's crazy? It's never successful people telling you to grind. <laughs> never notice that? Never is. Warren Buffett never goes jogging wearing a t-shirt that says, all day, air day. No. Grind's just a concept invented by corporations to increase the productivity of workers. <laughs> but you know what? I hope robots do take our jobs. When they do, the first job they take is writing motivational quotes. <laughs> so we can focus on jobs that robots can't do, you know, like creating art. I know what you're thinking, you're like, oh, well, actually, part of you know, robots can use artificial intelligence now to create art, and it's only a matter of time before their art is better than our art. It's like, yeah, maybe, but for the time being, they still need my help to tell them which photos have stop signs in them. <laughs> so until that changes, I'm going to let them do the grinding. My name is Pardis Parker. Thank you for coming to my TED Talk.